So with that reward token, 70% of it, you're going to want to sell um, and buy Pulse X with right away. Okay. 10% of it, of the coin, no, excuse me, 80%, you're going to want to dump right away and buy more Pulse X. 10% of it, you're going to want to keep just to see whatever happens with it. Who knows? It could be great, right? Pulse X is going to do more X than X's than most of them. So why are you holding it? Be okay. So you got 80% you sold for Pulse X to feed your mechanism. 10% you're just keeping it up to the coin to see what happens. And the other 10% you're going to put in a stable coin. Okay. And the second part of this I want to tell you, you want to do this every day. This is probably the most important, one of the most important things. Every day you want to sell the, your reward token. Every day, generally speaking, the rewards for the pool will go down. Okay, so you want to cash 100%. This is not financial advice by no means. But anyways, so every day you're going to want to cash out the rewards. Okay, mathematically speaking, every day that passes, the rewards will be lower, blah, blah, blah. So every day you want to you want to cash that 100% out of that token. 80% of it feed back into the Pulse X mechanism. 10%, the other 10%, 10%. You keep in a stable coin to buy the dip. So you're accumulating the stable coin every day, a little little bit to buy the big dip when it comes. No, that's really helpful. Thanks, Benjamin. So an inst institutional real estate company, uh, institutional grade real estate company will be launching on Pulse Chain. Um, they contacted Mandalorian. So if you're curious about it, ask him about it because he has hella information. Nice. So the one thing that uh, I will say is that uh, there's mass adoption coming, number one. And two, real estate companies today have it within their code to start looking up and studying cryptocurrency. Richard Hart slowly but steadily has gained more of a following. Um, I think now he's, I mean, last time I checked, he was at 209.8 followers on uh Twitter, but uh, back when the they did that Twitter storm, he was under two hundred thousand. So that's ten thousand more follow, you know, over ten thousand more followers that he's gained, you know. And those followers, I believe, are going to be investors. Um, when we when we look at how many people invested in Pulse X, right, um, that have now refitted their bags with fresh fiat and other things that they were ready to dollar cost average into the um, the pulse chain train. I, I think that we're, we're in a stage of excitement and we can never know how many people are truly on the sidelines waiting. But I know we have fresh people that have, that aren't hexagons, that aren't pulse -icans, that aren't pulse hexagons that are ready to go in on day one, including companies that couldn't sacrifice during the ICO because there was no price attached to it. We're, we're in for a treat. He is going to go down in history as a really, really important figure. And for us to have access to him at this level is, is quite a gift. And he's attracted and assembled this amazing community, but it's just a reflection of of Richard Hart, but um, we also have the luxury of being able to pay attention and learn from a lot of things that he teaches in crypto that you don't hear from anyone else. He gets a lot of flack for it because he says a lot of blunt things that a lot of people don't like, and that's okay. That'll be washed over in time. But here we are, um, you know, at the precipice of launching one of the best projects and products uh, pulse chain is coming on with pulse x it'll revolutionize our crypto world in a way that people just don't understand yet but we'll look back you know five years ten years from now and you'll have the luxury to say that oh i was at that time you get to tell your grandkids that you had exposure to all these people who are going to be celebrities in the world so um, it's a very exciting time, and uh, the ecosystem, the Hex ecosystem, will prove once and for all that we're not a scam, 
and that we are the best thing that's happened to crypto. And uh, you, you, you are at the right place at the right time. You're going to see this evolution of strength. And that is unheard of in any other community. So we are building on top of it on every level, not just on Hex, but Pulse, Pulse X. And who's building it? Other Hexicans. So, you know, just to, just as put that in perspective, one of the best products that's built in the last two or three years is Staker app. It's a, it's a revolutionary type of product. It's built by two guys, Steph and Firebun. Those two guys are just two Hexicans. They were here in our, in our Telegram group, in the Hex.com, like everyone else, chit-chatting, commenting, arguing, discussing. And they met, and they discussed, and they kind of got together. And they decided, hey, let's do something. So those two guys is the level of intelligence that we have in this community, which is unbelievable. So imagine when that starts to spring up and all these other things are being built around Hex and Pulse. So uh, in, in a couple of years, you're going to have all these products being built and we're going to be looking at tons and tons of different game theory and we will have the benefit of four or five years worth of data that we can analyze and it's just going to make everything that much more uh, if we talk about stickiness, um, it'll be really, really exciting at that time. Crypto Goose, what do you think the new people need to do besides this investing, you know, getting into Pulse X, Pulse Chain, Hex? What's going to serve them best to move themselves forward with um, the opportunity that we have here? Make sure you have a financial goal. Everyone comes into crypto for different reasons, many, many reasons. Make sure that you have a goal, a strategy, and not, not a 48-hour strategy. What I'm talking about is a short-term and long-term goal. How are you going to exit your position? How are you going to realize your gains? Uh, part of that has to do with taxes and things. These are real-life things you have to deal with. And recognize that those are real things that you're going to have to deal with. And if you don't have a goal... It gets a little bit messy later on. So um, many people don't have a financial goal. They don't even know what it means. Like they want to get in and they want to make money and they want to get rich. But they haven't thought about what being rich means. Like what does that actually mean? So to figure that out is very important because then once you figure it out, then you can build a strategy to obtain those goals. And then there are people in here and elsewhere in our community who can help you understand some of the tools that are being coming out to achieve all those goals, X being a perfect one. So that's kind of the things I would like to uh, share with new people.